What is going on guys? It's your boy Aries the Greek and in this video I'm gonna be screwing around with the sniper. I'm gonna be using the USR. It's been forever since I last brought you guys a sniper video. I do apologize about that. I know I did say after I finished up with the whole ghillie suit series that I was gonna come back every now and again and bring you guys a sniper video but obviously I haven't done that. I got away from it. What I think happened really was um I more got into the road to the gold bulldog and I've really been t focusing my time and energy on that series and really never thought about pulling out the sniper. But I did wake up today kind of in a sniping mood that happens to me every now and again. More it's when I get bored of Call of Duty, I always pull out the sniper. That's always something I can do. I enjoy sniping, I'm just not very good at it. So if you guys have been with me through my ghillie suit, you kind of know how my sniping is. If you haven't been with me though, just to let you guys know, you know I'm not the world's greatest sniper. I'm really not that good. I have my good games every now and again, but try not to judge me too hard in this one. I do have a feeling it's not going to be the greatest game I, just because I really haven't sniped in a long time. You know, I do pull it out every now and again. Especially, you know, if I'm struggling or if I'm just really bored. I've probably played with it maybe 15, 20 times since the Ghillie Suit series. So, really not that many times. And if you guys remember in the series, you know, when I didn't play with it for a week or a couple days or something like that, my um, skill level actually ended up going down. So, for that reason, I do feel I'm a struggle a little bit. We did start out kind of strong, especially... Uh, we died it right up front on a terrible snipe. I just missed a kill I should have had. Then we came back actually really strong, and I'm surprised about that. It could have just been luckier. That could be things to come. But we are on Warhawk, and I chose this map for a reason. Because Warhawk is always my best sniping map. Always has been, always will be. I love this map for sniping. I don't know why for me, but the kills come easy. And I'm what spotted. I think it really is, is I kind of have two spots that I sit at on this map. And you'll kind of see it throughout this video of what I do to snipe. And the first place, obviously, is right here. I can sit in here, but this isn't even my primary place. My real primary place that I like to sit is actually down the alley to the left of me right here. If I sit down there, people just tend to run right down the alley. And I can kind of just pick them off with the sniper rifle. So I do find it to be really easy on this map to snipe. If you're not a sniper, try to snipe on this map. See if you can't do it. I think you'll find it to be a little easier than you would have thought. You know, pretty much every other map I'll struggle on, but I don't think I really ever have a terrible sniping game on Warhawk. So like I said, I mean, if you're not, go and get, just sit in these two little places. You know, I don't really condone camping that much. But with the sniper, I guess it's kind of okay. You know, at least you you have somewhat of an excuse of why you're sitting in one place. But anyway, guys, we are 11-3, and, and I'm finding this really hard to believe that I'm having this good of a game. And it's not only the kills, my accuracy is just on point in this one. And I can't believe it. It was a great game to record. Usually when I have an idea like this where I'm like, you know, I'm going to pull out the sniper rifle or something like that. I'll always pull it out and record a video and I'll have a terrible game. Like it'll just be god awful. I'll go like like five and five and ten or something, and it just won't be worthy of putting on YouTube. So I can't believe I am playing this good. This is actually my first like game that I've played on the sniper rifle. I was really expecting it just to be god awful. So I wish I could have had this kind of a game in the ghillie suit series. Don't get me wrong. If you guys remember, you know I had my games. I really did. I had a couple that were pretty, pretty damn good. And a couple, you know, that weren't the best. But if I could have had a game like this every single time, the series would have gone by so much quicker. It really would have. But I can't believe we're already, def what, 15 kills? You know, that was always my goal in the ghillie suit series. I didn't have that many games I don't, that I remember, you know, I feel like the Ghillie Suit series was so long ago, which it really wasn't. But I, don't, I didn't have that many games that I really remember being all, like, that great over 15 kills. So to already start out this strong is really does come as a surprise. Ah, I can't believe we got that kill right there. I thought I was screwed. Ah! Oh my gosh, I, I can't believe I'm doing this good. Like, it, this is just mind-blowing to me. It really is. No! Ah, oh, we got lucky. We got lucky. Like I said, I mean, it's just my accuracy that's really surprising me. We're hitting most of these people on one shot. I'm, I'm really used to two-shotting them. Like, I always miss. I always called it my warning shot more as a joke. Like, 
always missed to the left, and then I'd get my accuracy together. Ah, there we go. It hit him. Ah, we got the kill, though. That's one of the problems I find on the USR, though. You know, I used to always use the other sniper, and God, it's been so long. Like, I haven't used it probably in six months now, and... I you guys will know the name. It's the L whatever sniper. I forget the name of it. But I used to always use that. I did find that sniper to be a little more powerful. Like it was rare that if I hit someone, it didn't get the kill. But I did switch to the USR in the ghillie suit series. And I never really looked back. I do like the sniper a lot more. But one of the complaints I do have on it is I do find this sniper to be very inconsistent. I can get into a game where I can one shot everybody. And it will get the kill. And then I can get into the next game where I can't kill someone on the first shot. Like, I don't know. I don't know what it is about the USR and that. And I'm still, I'm using a chrome barrel and something else. I might be using extended mags or something. But I do have the damage up. It's not like I'm using a bunch of attachments that are lowering the damage. So I don't, I don't know what it is. But we are to 25 kills. We're 25 and 7 right now. This is a great game for me. Like, you might be saying, oh, it's not that impressive, but for my skill and what I usually do, like, this is really good, really impressive. So I'm pretty proud of myself in this one. I would love to get to, like, 27 kills. If I can get two more, I'd be really happy about that. But I'm not going to complain if I finish up here with 25 kills. It is what it is. Ah, we screwed up. We choked there. We choked. Ah, we kind of fell apart here at the end. Well, not really fell apart, but... We didn't stay stay at the um, powerful level that we were at. We were just wrecking for a while. So ever since the beginning, I went on that little streak. I was like, ah, it's just a streak. I'm not going to do it. But we never really let up. But this game is coming to a close. I have a feeling we're going to finish with 25 kills. Ah, there it is. But it is what it is. 25, that's really good for me. I really enjoyed it. But um, hopefully I can get back and really start doing these sniper videos again. I like doing them. But anyway, guys, I'm going to go ahead and end it there. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you're not subscribed, make sure to hit that sub button. But anyway, this has been your boy, Aries the Greek. Hey, guys, peace out.